What's the deal y'all? Here we are at Galveston Fishing Pier enjoying a beautiful and extremely rare day. A phenomenon that only happens like five times out of the year. Clean green water. The wind and the currents have perfectly aligned which created these perfect conditions for Spanish mackerel. So unfortunately these conditions are very short lived. I'm fishing the high tide with subtle winds out of the southeast. I'm only going to fish the first two hours because after high tide the winds are going to speed up and the water is going to stain. Alright let's do it. So up until this point, I've thrown about five different lures with no luck. One thing that I noticed is that the guys that were using shrimp were not getting any hits at all. Spanish mackerel love live shrimp. So when I noticed that, I actually switched my lures from brown to more reflective lures. Here I'm casting a bomber long A. Huh? Where'd you hook it at? Another thing that I noticed was that the people that were using light shrimp we're using steel leaders. They weren't getting any hits with that. So I actually switched to a 50 pound fluorocarbon <laughs> leader. As we go further into the video, we'll see that the two people in that whole pier that were using fluorocarbon got the biggest Spanish mackerel. Yeah. <laughs> yep. All right. See that I end up losing it right here. What up? Okay, grab the line for you. I got it. Watch out. I'm gonna flip it. Gotta make sure this is actually a Spanish mac or not a kingfish. Why? Okay. <laughs> yeah, that's good. Oh, that's a Spanish mac. No. <laughs> Yeah, it's a Spanish mac. We're probably till like next week. Woo, Will. Time that shit, bro. <laughs> you gonna need the net for that? Oh, dude, that's a that's a kingfish, man. Go way back. Lead as fuck, Root Will. Hell yeah, dude. Oh, damn, did you see that? That was aggressive, dude, that was crazy. <laughs> damn, in the scrubs, like a boss. Well, that's it. I know that there were only three smacks caught, but they were solid as fuck. But you know what, we're actually just happy with just one smack. Mainly because Spanish mackerel are so rare in the upper Texas coast. They're very particular fish, especially the green water. You see, we have dirty brown murky waters in the upper Texas coast. We don't get Spanish mackerel very often, maybe like four days out of the year. And when we get these conditions, we embrace them. We don't go to work, we call in to fish these green conditions. We'd rather fish green conditions than make money. <laughs> well anyways, that's it. Until next time.